is something that you'll get notice of when you start. It's called NAP tutoring. And they have second degree specific um, tutors. Now, if you have that mindset that tutors are needed when you don't know anything, nursing school, let's face it, none of us know any of this. So we need all the help we can get. And I know myself and the more time I spend in the material and honestly, you're gonna have long days and it's nice to have somebody lead you um, through your material again, touch base on it. I probably went to several for fundamentals, health assessment, because in the beginning, everything's a little overwhelming. You don't know what tests are gonna be like. You don't know what you're supposed to pull out is like very important information and spending time in the material cannot be understated. Um, so I would say take advantage of those um, and find time to meet with your professors if you need it, because they are down to give you advice, give you nuggets, give you tips on how past students succeeded. Um, and usually they're an hour and they're great for weeks coming up to test because you've got a lot going on. So it's a great way to schedule that time. Um, so don't get overwhelmed that it's like tutoring. Don't go there when you're doing bad, go there from the beginning. Uh, they all work with our schedule and they don't cost you a thing. We're already, you know, we're already paying. It's just an added resource. And honestly, I also would say go to all of the HESI reviews, make time, do everything you can to spend time in the material. Because let's face it, it's your full-time job for the next year. So um, my, I could sing up and down all day about NAP tutors. So um, go and then go again and then go again the next week. Yeah, to go off of what Mara said, it's just a great resource um, that's provided for us. You can pick what classes you wanna attend, how often you wanna go. It's a great review for tests or just um, having the material presented in a different way if maybe something didn't make sense to you, but just eliminate that um, negative connotation of tutoring as if you need help before you even need help. <laughs> just go um, and you'll learn and review. And it is nice, especially being in a virtual the virtual world that we are to have a smaller um, group and you can talk to people more easily rather than um, in a big lecture. I completely agree with both of them. Um, I found myself going to tutoring almost every week from the beginning of the semester to the end. And aside from the group tutoring that they would have, I also met one on one with my tutors because I just felt like I needed that extra support and guidance. So I would do that often. And I built great rapports with them too. So they're always like a resource for you to use as well, even outside of those classes, because they've been through most of these nursing classes already. Um, and then I don't know if anyone has mentioned this yet, but another aspect of tutoring, I would say is open lab. Um, when the lab is open because a lot of the like health assessment skills and like fundamental skills, you'll need to have those down for when you start clinicals. And those were really helpful to me. I found myself in those weekly as well.